Today in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install mods for Smash Ultimate on the new Eden Nintendo Switch emulator. This is the latest emulator for Nintendo Switch. If you want to get the best performance for any game pretty much on Switch, this is probably the best emulator you should use. And it has mod support, obviously, because I'm making this video. So let's jump, jump right into it real quick. It's going to be pretty simple, and I'll put this together all nicely for you guys. So before we get jumping right into it, though, before we jump right in, Please note, obviously, you need to get your own ROMs for this, DLC updates, uh, whatever have you, for Smash Ultimate. I will not be supplying that for you, obviously, because it's piracy. So it's up to you to obtain that. Uh, and, of course, your product key files, key files you need for the emulator to work, all that kind of stuff, that's up to you to get. Uh, if you don't know how to dump your own stuff, uh, Google is your friend. Google is your friend for pretty much all of this, so that's all I'll tell you. But, of course, I can't go into piracy. So, anyway, uh, let's move on to everything. So, once you do have your ROM and all everything, however you got it, once you have it all here on uh, your emulator, I wish I got mine here. Uh, I have all my update data DLC already. That's all taken care of. So you're going to see in the link in the description of this video, you're going to see a video that's a uh, link that takes you to a Google Drive link. And in that Google Drive link, you're going to have this sdmc.rar file. This is going to pretty much have everything in there that you need uh, just to install basic mods. Uh, if you want to install maybe moveset mods or stuff like that, you're probably going to need more Pacific like plugins. Uh, whenever you're downloading a mod like that, just check the mod description. It'll probably tell you which plugin you need, what are, what's required for it. Uh, so this is this tutorial is pretty much just to get you started. Uh, any plugins that are required for any additional like moveset mods, of course, like I said, uh, you'll find that probably on the download page for the mod that you're trying to download. So uh, yeah, that's all pretty much hand and dandy there. Uh, so what you're going to do is when you're in edit here, you're going to go up to file and you're going to go to open root folder. You see this here. And you're going to click SDMC folder. You're going to click this. And the S the SDMC file that I gave you, that you downloaded from the link in the description, you're going to see there's an atmosphere and there's an ultimate folder in here. You can literally just drag these and drag it right into the root of your SDMC folder. And that's it. And you're good to go. Just literally drag it in here. I already have it in here, so I'm not going to do that. So literally whatever RAR file you have, WinRAR, whatever you're using, just drag it in here, boom, and you'll be set to go. So if this is asking to replace anything, you can do that. That's fine. There's no real issues with that. Just drag that in there, boom, that's it. So, once you have that in there, um, that's pretty much the gist of it. There's really not a whole lot. Once you drag that in there, you're pretty much good to go. And of course, Edin, like I said before, is setting up the whole emulator with your ROMs, uh, whatever whatever it is, that's all up to you, obviously, getting all that stuff. Uh, but from the modding point, point of it, that's literally it. Now, what you need to do is, is to get your mods. Of course, you can go to Game Banana Smash for that. I'll go ahead and pull it up here real quick. Uh, I was actually looking at earlier here. So this is the game banana page uh, for Smash Ultimate. Uh, as you can see here, this is where you got all your skins, sound mods, music mods, whatever have you. Uh, I actually already downloaded a mod though for this video specifically. Uh, so I'll go ahead and open that. So when you're installing skin mods or whatever it may be, you're going to want to go to your ultimate folder and you're going to open up mods. Click this. And I already have a bunch of whole or whack load of stuff in here. Uh, but just to show you as an example, here's a skin mod I have. It's a mod for Zero Six Samus. So whatever is here, the folder that it's in, I'm just going to go ahead simply and drag it into the ultimate mods folder. And the mod is now in there. And there you go. Pretty simple to do. And that's really it. You're ready to start modding or start playing with your mod, have you, whatever have you. Um, so yeah, I'm going to open up the game now here on Eden and I'll show you that it's uh, running flawlessly. All right, as you can see, I'm in here in game and ultimate. And the mod that I installed is right here. It's the uh, Brawl version of Zero Suit Samus, so I can go into in-game here. And I can show you the mod is working flawlessly. As you can see, it showed the portrait there. So everything should be good and dandy. And as you can see, it does work here. So whatever mod you're using, it should come up pretty simple. Uh, if you, as long as you do everything that I showed you correctly, uh, you should be good to go. Um, as you can see, there's a little bit of stutters here. That's because I haven't really been using Eden for very long, so it's still building shaders. Uh, one thing I will point out, though, is that Eden is much better at building shaders, I've noticed, than Yuzu really is, which is great. Because uh, Yuzu is pretty old now, uh, but Eden is actually built off of Yuzu. Uh, so it's really nice to see improvements like that, because sometimes the shader building for some games on Yuzu was horrible. But it doesn't seem too bad here. It's actually really good. Just really nice. Um, but uh, yeah, that aside, that's really it for the video. Well, if you do is what I showed you earlier very uh, correctly, just drag that in there. You'll be all good to go. And now you can play uh, Smash Ultimate 1 on Eden Emulator with mods. Pretty simple. Uh, yeah, thank you for watching. If it was any helpful, if this was helpful anyway, be sure to leave a like and a comment below. Hit that subscribe button would mean a lot. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.